episode of Awkward Victoria. Today I am vlogging with my loser dad, which is, this is him. Hi. <laughs> you guys don't see him much in my vlogs. He pops up here and there when I ask him questions, but he's really not, you know, there. Um, we are going into Ace Hardware and Ace we gotta go Hardware. to, and we gotta go to Walmart. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna vlog today as I promised. Can I, can I talk by DJ voice? Is this your DJ voice, Dad? It was when I used to be in radio. That's why he is my loser dad. <laughs> well, we just came back from Ace Hardware. We got some rind seed grass. Rind, rind. Right, sorry. Rind, rind seed grass. Uh, excuse me, I gotta pursue. His. I, I, I assume my persona. He's, he's gotta go back into his DJ persona. Um, there was a cat there, I didn't vlog it, but there was a cute little kitty cat there and when my dad picked up the bag of uh, seeds, the cat got scared and ran away. His name was Ace, because, you know, after Ace Hardware, but he's a cute kitty. And, um, but we're off to Walmart. We're going to Walmart. After we drop off everything. After we drop off everything, DJ Dad. Well, it's the drop off everything first and then we'll go to Walmart because my dad has a smart car and a smart car doesn't have a lot of um, a lot of space in the back. Smart so. like me. <laughs> but anyways, I guess I'll vlog going to Walmart. I'll try talking there. I'm not still used to vlogging in public. Um, the fair was actually my first time vlogging in public. Uh, that was, it was actually not as scary as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be really stupid and people were going to look at me kind of stupid. But actually, I guess because technology, people were always talking in their cameras. I guess it's, they're just like, whatever. So they're used to seeing it. So yes, we're going to go to Walmart and I'll vlog that. So I was going to vlog in Walmart and then I completely spazzed when I got in there and I didn't vlog in Walmart. So sorry about that I was gonna vlog in public and people were gonna see me vlog in public um, I guess I completely spazzed because I'm still getting used to the fact of you know going in public bringing on camera and actually talking to it like I'm a crazy person so uh, I forgot to do that so but that's okay I'll keep vlogging throughout the day hopefully it doesn't have to be somewhere so when I get home I'll vlog a little bit maybe I'll tell you guys a little story about my life like I usually do um, I am going to be releasing the video today, which is Saturday, uh, or at least Saturday for me. And the reason why is because I work tomorrow from 12 until 6. So I'll be releasing the video early today, or later today, uh, for you guys to view. Um, but whenever it gets uploaded, it gets uploaded. Anyways, uh, yeah. You guys don't know this, but I had a car. I have a car. You guys know I have a car and the transmission needs to be replaced on it. Now, replacing a transmission is pretty expensive. I have one third of the money, but I don't have a lot of the money. I went into a gas station and I was like, why not, I'll get a lottery ticket. And on that lottery ticket, I won $120 on this lottery ticket. $120. I never win shit. It put so much stress off of me right now. And this is life giving me a nice little sorry for your transmission and sorry that your life was shit. <laughs> My dad is really upset right now. I never win crap. He, he buys lottery tickets every week. Right? Every week? Big fat zero. <laughs> His little child has a little luck in her. Maybe I should buy your lottery tickets. <laughs> Alright, but I thought the vlog that I experienced, because there was only one other time in my life that I won money and it was a hundred dollars. I got it from like a Publix, like little put five dollars in and it was a five dollar one. This one is also a five dollar one and I won a hundred and twenty dollars. And I, I, I should have vlogged me scratching it off and showing you guys my face because I was elbowing my dad like 20 times going, holy shit, <laughs> doing that. I was so happy. I'm super happy. I wish you guys were here. You guys saw my reaction, but I'm super happy. Right I'm going to buy a lottery ticket. Maybe you should have bought it where I got it. Uh, 
I probably would have gotten a big zero. <laughs> Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. We're about to head home. But yes, I'm super happy about this. So, oh, it's recording. So I'm back home. I, like I said, I was going to vlog today. I actually do have a little challenge. Uh, Squash, my friend, uh, challenged me to do the fridge challenge. I decided to do the fridge challenge for one of my vlogs. As you guys know, or if you guys don't know, the fridge challenge is basically where you look in your fridge, you choose items, you have to put it all in one container and you have to eat or drink it. You have to choose five items, mix it together. And it has to be, I guess, not the best tasting in the world. Um, also, it turns out that the lottery ticket, I read it wrong, it says I won 12 prizes that were shown. I still won $100. I didn't want 120 but I won $100, which I'm so happy about because that is going towards my transmission, and I am happy about that. Now, for this challenge, I have to pick items. So, here we go. I'm going to pick lime juice. Uh, I guess we'll make it a little sweet. We'll add some strawberry jam. Nothing sponsored, by the way. Um, let's add some pickle juice. Pickle juice. Uh, got two sours. I'll add some Coca-Cola vanilla. And I gotta choose one more. Yeah, Jesus, I don't know. Uh, how about some chocolate? That sounds good. Chocolate syrup, pickle juice, lime juice, Coca-Cola, and jelly. Strawberry jelly. All right, let's see. Mom, can you come here and hold this for me? Mom, my, my lovely assistant mom is holding the camera for me because I can't do this all at the same time. I am adding... Chocolate syrup. If I can get it out. It's cold. I'll add some chocolate. Here. Some pickle juice. I don't like pickles. So this this is not gonna be fun for me. That's why I picked pickle juice. I do not like pickles. Okay, pickle juice. Lime juice, which is very delicious and guacamole. Lime juice. I got some vanilla Coca-Cola, and you guys are gonna hate me. I don't like vanilla Coke. <laughs> and this is my sister, so whenever she watches this, she's gonna be quite upset with me. Um, I'm more of a uh, cherry Coke girl. Uh, strawberry jam for a little bit more sweetness to it. And I guess we can... It smells horrible. <laughs> Mom, do you want to smell it? Uh, nope. <laughs> now, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to drink the whole thing. I really don't want to be sick, so I don't think I'll get sick from it, but... I'm pretty sure this won't set all my stomach. I'll probably have to drink, eat some tongues or something after this. Okay. Ugh! It smells like pickled Coca-Cola. That's what it smells like. It's actually not too bad. I'm a weird person, Mom. <laughs> like... It's like the lime juice gives it like a good taste. The jelly gives it, I mean, this is actually not that bad. You made a new brand of barbecue sauce. It's actually very good. Put it on your ribs. No, oh, what, my chest ribs or? No, barbecue <laughs> ribs. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna drink the whole thing. I'm scared that I'm still gonna die of something. But that's actually really good. Should I drink more? Okay, that was a little bit horrible. The jelly gave it a weird texture. Okay, I drank it all. 
Or I champed it up. I drank it off. Drank it. Drank it off. That's actually not bad. My eyes look like they're watering, but it was actually pretty good. Okay. So guys, today was pretty eventful. I did the what's in my fridge challenge. Again, I did chocolate sauce, pickle juice, strawberry jam, vanilla Coca-Cola, and what was the other one? Uh, lime juice. And it actually was not that bad. Yeah, it's sitting kind of funny on my stomach because it's, a for it's probably very foreign for my stomach to eat it, but it was actually pretty good. Um, I, I think my mom wants to actually try that as a rub on something. I don't know what. I mean, hey, it tasted great, so I guess you try it. I guess that wasn't really... I mean, my stomach hurts, but if I die, I just want you guys to know that I love you very much. <laughs> I'm not gonna die, I'm just saying. Um, that is gonna be it for my vlog. I have so much homework, it's not even funny. I didn't do anything last weekend because I was super busy. Tomorrow I have work, so I got a pile on the homework. I know you guys probably don't want to see me do math homework and it's business calculus, so I'm learning all about Prime and stuff like that. So it's pretty boring for you guys to watch. Um, but that's going to end my vlog for today. I hope you guys stay amazing like you always are. And I hope you guys like my vlogs. Of course, give like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, Awkward Victoria. Uh, thank you again for 2,000 subscribers. I really, really appreciate it. Again, this is a huge dream for me. So this really means a lot to me that you guys love my videos and everything like that. I really appreciate everything that you guys have given me. Uh, and that's it. That's all I got for you guys for today. Anyways, I can't do this with two hands, so I'm going to have to do... It with one hand. Anyways, my name is Awkward Victoria. <laughs> I actually worked. And I'll see you guys later.